Hello everyone, welcome to TV channel. Lizzie Young's family in 2022. Lizzie Young is a South Korean model, actress, and amateur boxer. She was born in North Jongjong, South Korea, in April of 17, 1982. Lizzie is the second child out of the three siblings. She has one brother and one sister. She was born into a middle class family. Lee was always inspired in rising above her middle class upbringing to do something worthwhile in her life. She grew up in the now dissolved Jiangwon County before moving to the big city, Seoul, at the age of 9. Since she was a child, she has been a tomboy who likes to do non traditionally feminine activities. When Lee had spent 9 years in the countryside, her dad had said that she would be fighting with boys. During her schooling, she developed an affinity towards fitness and at the same time started dreaming about being an actress. She endured herself in boxing during her school days, which also helped her in achieving a ton physique, which further resulted in a lot of modeling and acting offers. She debuted in the acting world with a guest appearance in the 2008 series, Urban Legends Deja Vu. Lizzie Young was also side bright when it came to her studies. She started modeling and took her all time before embarking into the acting field. And meanwhile, she also kept wrapping herself up for boxing. As her popularity rose in the industry, she backed a major role in the historical drama series The Kingdom of Dreams. 2009 belonged to her as she took up many brilliant roles that established her as a highly competent TV actress. She also ventured into films with Five Sense of Bearers and later appeared in popular movies like Killer Tune and The Divide Move. Apart from winning several awards for her boxing skills in the 48kg category, she has won awards for her acting skill as well. She won the host of awards for her performances in the series, Becoming a Millionaire and The Writer's Live. In 2016, she also won the Best Joy Award at the Asia Artist Awards. As for dating, Lee revealed that she always seems to date a bad boy. Her ex-boyfriend was caught cheating on her with other girl. So, this time, her family asked her to meet someone that is similar to her, including the economy part. In early 2009, Lee was filming the reality show We Got Married with Jun Jin, a member of the boy band Sunwa. In the show, Lee was in fact married with Jun Jin and both get a nickname of Good Dam Couple because she liked to play with Good Dam. They got married on January 30, 2009, and her appearance started as a couple on the Lunar Special. Lee was famous for being a pushover to Jun Jin because of her tomboy personality. Then, they got divorced on May 3, 2009 due to the program's restructure. After the show ending, the both were confirmed to be dating each other and become the first couple to date each other outside the show. However, they broke up on September 9 after dating for 6 months. From both sides, they didn't give any further information about their breakup. In September 2016, Lee was reported dating with a businessman and older than her. Her company confirmed the news and when it came out, they got married on September 30, 2017 at a hotel in Seoul. The event was attended only by family and friends. Her husband is a businessman named Jo sung yun who is 9 years older than her. Jo is a restaurateur who is running Yun Jung Movie, Salad Young Restaurant, an American Godware brand, Ilya Golf. At the time, they have been dating for only about a month. After finishing filming the drama Lockout in 2017, Lee announced her pregnancy and her wedding plan on her Instagram. When she announced her pregnancy, she was about 14 weeks pregnant. At first, she wasn't aware of her pregnancy while filming the drama. For the sake of drama, Lee and her family decided to keep her pregnancy as a secret to not making any damage to the production trend. During filming, she had to do wife scenes and action scenes. On January 7, 2018, Lizzie Young's agency revealed that the actress gave birth to a healthy son at the hospital in Seoul. On January 2021, actress Lizzie Young reveals her adoptable son for the first time ever on of NBC Point of Innocence Interference. She introduced viewers to her adoptable son, basically a clone of herself. 
On this episode, Lizzie Young will be spending the whole day with her sweetie pie son, Jung Jun. The two will be cooking and baking together, with Lizzie Young demonstrating her expert skill as a mother. So that's all the information about Lizzie Young and her family. If you are a fan of this actress, please share us the comment and don't forget to subscribe our channel to keep up to date. Thank you for watching.